In the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. So one more time from Matthew 25. This is Jesus describing the great judgment. I'll just read a couple of verses. Then the king will say to those on his right, Come, you who are blessed by my Father, take your inheritance, the kingdom prepared for you since the creation of the world. For I was hungry, and you gave me something to eat. I was thirsty, and you gave me something to drink. I was a stranger, and you invited me in. I needed clothes, and you clothed me. I was sick, and you looked after me. I was in prison, and you came to visit me. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. We now hear from our chapel choir. Friends in Christ, when Dr. Ferguson asked me to focus on the part of this passage that has to do with being in prison, he probably didn't know that I have been in prison multiple times. I remember the first time the best. I was a young pastor visiting a member of my parish in Minnesota. I was meeting him for the first time. He was a college-age guy. I remember signing all the forms, showing all the ID, emptying out my pockets, getting wanded, everything you can think of. The thing I remember most is stepping inside the door and the loud click of the super seal electronic locks on the door behind me once I was in, and I remember thinking, the only way I can get out of here is if somebody lets me out. Even though I was just visiting, I was locked in. I think I had a pretty good visit with Brian that day. I don't know. I reminded him 